Hello, and thank you for watching the transportation safety video for proper procedures of student loading and unloading, and the roles of school staff and bus drivers. The district is making a standard procedure for all based off of best practices. In this video, we're going to focus on loading a student in a wheelchair at their bus stop. Driver parks in a safe level area, mindful of space for wheelchair loading. Turn on eight lights or hazards, secure a bus, Turn off bus, take key, and disengage front door air. Take cover off ramp, exit front door, and close behind. Open and secure wheelchair door. Deploy and lower lift to ground level. Load the wheelchair onto ramp. Student should face away from the bus. On electric chairs, be sure to turn the power off. Doing this sets the brakes. On a manual chair, be sure to set the brake and make certain the chair is in an upright position. Chairs should only be reclined if medically necessary. Secure the ramp safety belt, making sure the ramp flap is up and secure. Driver will ride with the chair if there is room. A hand must always hold or clasp onto the chair for stability. Raise lift. Watch your heels and hold on to the chair. Once fully raised, release the wheelchair brakes. Back chair into the bus, watching your head. Place chair in wheelchair station and set the brakes. Tie down chair using all four point tie downs. Two front and two in the rear. Store wheelchair trays if applicable. Secure shoulder strap, making sure straps are not twisted and or rubbing against the child's neck. Test securement by gently shaking or rocking the chair to see if it will move. Tighten straps as needed. Exit the bus, closing the door behind you. Store lift in the folded position inside vehicle. Close and secure the lift door. Enter the bus and engage door air. Close the door and return cover onto the wheelchair ramp lift. Now onward to the next stop. A school staff member may assist in this process by removing the ramp cover, supervising the children already on the bus, receive the student in the wheelchair once it is raised by releasing the wheelchair brakes, or placing the chair in the wheelchair station and setting the brakes. Important note, the bus driver must operate the wheelchair lift when a student is being raised or lowered and the bus driver is responsible for installing the wheelchair tie-downs and ensuring that the wheelchair is secure. At the Kent School District, safety is our number one priority for students and staff. We hope you find the videos valuable for your safety training and appreciate your care for the students and families that we all serve.